Good morning, children. Praise the Lord. We meet again today. Stay happy and healthy in this new day. Before we start our activities, let us start the day with a meditation with God's word this morning. And today, let's continue our adventure to know God's creation from God's amazing creation book. And this morning, we will learn from the title, Me First. Before we proceed, shall we start with a prayer. Thank you, Lord, for the new day. Now we are ready to listen to your words. May your Holy Spirit be within us to lead us and bless us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our memory verse for today is from Matthew chapter 19, verse 30. It says, Many who are first will be last, and many who are last will be first. Children, you probably seen alphabet posters in your school's classroom. In the lower grades, the alphabet is printed in black letters, and about third grade, it's in cursive. But no matter how it's written, the letters stay in the same order, A to B, B to C, all the way to X, Y, and Z. Once you learn the alphabet, it will come in handy for the rest of your life. Open a phone book. All the names are in alphabetical order. How great if your last name is Aaron. Your name will be one of the first listed on the very first page. But if your name is Saidaka, guess where you'll be? You'll be at the end of the book. In the animal kingdom, the artwork is usually listed first. And once you get to know this creature, you'll see that it's not because it's beautiful. It's those two A's at the beginning of its name. The art park is strictly nocturnal, comes out at night, so most people never see one. They have long, narrow snouts, long tongues, and very sticky saliva, which makes it easy for them to catch ants and termites, their favorite foods. Artfarks dig or root in the ground as pigs do, so they are sometimes called earth pigs. Children, being first may or may not be a great thing. In today's text, Jesus was talking to people who thought that being the richest and the best guaranteed them a great place in heaven. But Jesus wants us to understand that it's not what we have or where we are in line that makes a difference to Him. His grace and His love is the reason He's making a special place for you and me in His kingdom of heaven. This is the end of our morning worship. And praise the Lord for His word this morning that reminds us of how we will enter the kingdom of heaven, not because of our wealth, not because of our position, not because of our greatness, but all by God's love and grace. Therefore, children, today, pray to God so that He will remember you in His love and grace to give you a place in this is the end of our morning worship and praise the Lord for his word this morning that reminds us of how we will enter the kingdom of heaven 
not because of our wealth, not because of our position, not because of our greatness, but all by God's love and grace. Therefore, children, today, pray to God so that He will remember you in His love and grace to give you a place in His kingdom of heaven. May the Lord bless and protect all of the children on this wonderful day. Amen.